Dash Yamaha and Marine in Hanover, Pennsylvania. Northeast's largest express dealer and one of the largest express dealers in the nation. I'm Andy. I'm the express guy here at FNS. If you contact us, more than likely you'll be speaking with me. Through of a 2022 X23 Bay that we just got in stock. A lot of the videos that we do, I, uh, I'll do general overviews of just the model, but today I'm going to focus on just this boat uh, and talk in particulars about what we ordered with it. But it's a 2022 X23 Bay Lounge with the Yamaha 250 SHO. Tandem axle trailer is stock on the X23 Bays, but we upgraded to 15 inch tire and rims and also the saltwater uh, trailer package. And with that trailer package, you get plastic bunk covers and an upgraded bow roller. Two-tone paint, white upper, silver bottom. And you'll see here in a second with silver spray and liner. Hydraulic jack plate, 10 inch, which works the best with these uh, larger horsepower motors. A ladder on the rear. Like all expresses here at FNS, we thoroughly go through every boat to PDI it. And sometimes it takes a couple days for us to go through and check everything and make sure everything's good to go. There are always things that need repaired from a new boat from the factory. That's just how the boat industry is, but we're very thorough to go through it, each boat. And then after we do that, we put them in our, the motors in our test tank, do the first initial break-in in our test tanks, and then we go to the water to do a water test, because there are certain things that we can only test in the water, like leaks, live well leaks, propping. We have to go to the water to test those things. And we do that before you receive your boat. And then we also go with you to the water to show you how to use your boat as well with every customer. So you understand how it operates actually in the water. With the X series, this is Express's largest boat series that they make. It's 102 inches wide. It's a very wide, deep boat. Like all of their construction, this is an example of how their hulls put together. And this is, that was upside down, uh, the bottom of the boat. This would be the cross member. As you can see, the spraying foam. And then the floor, which every Express has the spraying liner throughout. Underneath every hatch, over every... Uh, compartment of the floor. It's sprayed very liberally everywhere. With the X-Series boats, you'll see a very large spray rail on the side of the boat to deflect the water. Express is hyperlift hull, which means that this is a pad hull. So in the very bottom of the boat, you will see a pad. And that pad is about 15 inches wide and about two feet long. So the idea is that when you're running fast with the motor trimmed up in the water, the only thing in the water is that pad. It makes the boat go faster, makes it ride better as well because there's very little actually of the boat in the water. Also take note of the hull with the aggressive steps and the very aggressive reverse chine. These expresses are very, very stable. You could have several people walk to the edge of that floor and this boat will not rock with how the whole design is. Performance wise with the 250 SHO, this boat will run upper 50s to 60 mile an hour depending on the conditions. But it'll also do it in two foot chop. You're going to wide open with this boat and two-foot chop, and it'll take it no problem. Of course, even bigger waves if, uh, if you back off the throttle, of course. But it's very capable. 
or aluminum boat. As you probably see online, Express has quite a reputation and, and they live up to it. It's uh, pretty incredible what these aluminum boats are capable of. Also with this one, we have the Bahama Blue Appearance Package, which with that package, you get sea deck and a little bit thicker sea deck, six millimeters up from the standard sea deck package. And then also too, with the Bahama Blue Appearance Package, you get the stripes and seats. You can see it there on the leaning post. And then, of course, Bahama Blue Sea Deck. With the X Series boats, they are a self bailing hull, which means if you get waves over the front that will self bail, you can see the self bailer right here. And also, too, it moves up to a 25 inch transom. So it's a deeper transom than what the rest of their series are. This is more designed for the rougher water. Jumping inside the boat. Bear with me, this is a high sided boat and I'm a little guy so it'll, uh, hopefully I won't fumble too much. <clears throat> Again, take note to the Bahama Blue Sea Deck. This is their lounge model, which means that up front, there is a lounge seat, which is a very large lounge seat. In front of the console, and this is a fish box. So you basically open this up. It's a very large fish box. It's insulated to put your catch in there. And there's also an oscillating pump that pumps out the fish box. Even things like ice that gets in there, it'll pump it out as long as the hose doesn't get clogged. That's part of this package. Another package with this boat is the Extreme Marsh Package. So with the Extreme Marsh Package, basically everything in stainless. You'll take note to the stainless grab rail, stainless rod holders, steering wheel, leaning post with backrest, and also footrest. Stainless steel push button switches in the dash. Also comes with, inside the console, the onboard charger and fuse panel. Again, that's all part of the Extreme Marsh package. And then this boat, we upgraded to a three bank charger because it's an upgraded 36 volt trolling motor. Hummingbird Helix 9 MSI in the dash that is linked to the Minn Kota Tarova 112 36 volt iPod link trolling motor. These are upgrades beyond what the uh, Extreme Marsh package offers. Most of our customers want the link trolling motors um, and to be connected to the fish finders, that way they communicate. Get a real good look at the color of the Bahama Blue. Appearance package is a cool color, it really pops. Silver spray and liner, as you can see throughout. Light package, so with the light package, the, in every compartment it is lit, and two lights, one on either side of the console to light up the side of the console as well. That's another package. Wash down pump is an upgrade. So there is a separate 
pump that pumps from the lake or river and then with a hose that you can wash down the interior of the boat. And that's the switch that is right here for the wash down. And that's the lights package. Wet sounds stereo system with four speakers. Another upgrade. You see the tachometer, fuel gauge, trim gauge, water pressure gauge. These X series boats are very deep. They're approximately 25 to 30% deeper than their other Bay series boats. Maybe I can show you, now I'm a little guy, but hopefully I can show you how deep these compartments are. I'll get inside here. I'm a... now they are a very deep, wide boat. Seventy five gallon fuel tanks, big fuel tank. No problem to run offshore with this boat. You see how deep everything is inside there with the well and whatnot. On the side of the boat, of the uh, well, you can see that's the washdown pump. And underneath the, the hoses there, you can see that's the oscillating pump out for the fish box. As of today, June 10th, 2022, this boat is for sale. If you have any questions with this boat or any of the expresses feel free to drop me a line you'll see all our contact information at the bottom of the screen we also welcome special orders we do a lot of that and we also always have a lot of express boats already on order which will shorten the wait time to receive a boat as well But feel free to shoot me a line and I'll explain what that means. Uh, it can be overwhelming as well with all the different packages and options. Um, but I make up info sheets uh, for all the series of express boats to help better understand what everything means. And I'll, uh, first I'll talk to you and then I'll send that email sheet to you, info sheet, um, to help explain better of, of what I mean, what all of it means. But thank you for watching. Feel free to shoot me a line with any questions.